Yo, what is up? This is the Gamer 101, and today I'm bringing you guys a prediction on the Rams versus the Patriots in Super Bowl 53. This is the Patriots' third trip to the Super Bowl in three years. The Brady's been in 10 Super Bowls now, and this is Goff's first Super Bowl. Now, I'm hoping that they don't break the Seahawks record for the NFC going to the Super Bowl two years in a row. I just hope the Rams don't break that. But, yeah. So, yeah. So, let's get right into it. Um, so, in the first quarter of the game, I have... Okay, so I'll have... And then... So, New England at um, Rams in the Super Bowl in Atlanta. So, I have New England in the first quarter will score zero, or Rams will score seven. In the second quarter, New England will score 14, and, and the Rams will score seven. So, it'll be 14 to 14 at halftime. Halftime. In the third quarter, New England will score 14 points, and... Uh, and Rams will score 14. So, yeah. So, right now it's 28 to 28. So, it's 28 to 28. In the fourth quarter. And then we'll score three. And then, okay, so. Now, my first position, this will be a little different, but I have New England on the same score. New England score 31 points. Yeah, and then in the fourth quarter, they're going to score seven. So, in the Super Bowl, F I N A L final. New England, 31. This is a more regional score than my first prediction. I have the Rams beating the Patriots in Super Bowl 53, 35-31. That is my final. But how this is going to go down, the Rams have a running back, Todd Gurley and C.J. Anderson. And the, um, and the Patriots have James White and Sony Mitchell. So those are two, four great running backs. James White is coming off a great postseason against the AFC Championship game and the AFC Divisional. But yeah, so Sony Mitchell and James White are coming off great postseason games. So I'm going to have the Rams with around, they've been averaging in their playoffs around 230, 250 rushing yards. So I'm going to have the Rams with Rush have them at about 225. Five have two around two two twenty two twenty five rushing yards two hundred and then okay so that'll be for and for us, and then for um and then for New England I'm gonna have them in around one eighty five I, I New England will have around one hundred eighty five rushing yards so that's for New England and that's for. And then, so yeah, and passing yards, and then, yeah. So, yeah, I'm going to have the Rams with around 300 rushing yards and New England with around 400. Well, I'm going to have New England with, I mean, Rams with around 400, too. So they'll have 800 passing yards combined. Might what I think it'll be. And then we have um sacks. So I'm going to have um the Rams with four sacks. And then New England with two. And then next we have INT. I'm going to have the Rams with three interceptions. 
Then I'm going to have the Patriots with two. So right now the Rams are leading in almost everything so far. And then, so, and then um, punting yards. So putting yards, I'm gonna have Rams with around 200, 230. So I'll put 200 to 230, and then I'm gonna have New England with around. I know that New England's gonna probably have more punting yards, so I'm gonna have them with around 300 rushing yards. So. And then in um, um, field goals, we have um, Steven Gotkowski going up against Greg Zerline. So I'm going to have, I say Steven Gotkowski will be three. No, wait, that wouldn't make sense. Yeah. No, yeah. Yeah, that wouldn't make sense. Field goals, um, Rams will be, um, O for O. Then Moon will be, um, two. No, no, no. It'll be one for two. It'll be one for two on field goals. Yeah. Okay, so, yeah. I think this is going to end this video. Now we'll see just how the Super Bowl ends out. This is my prediction. And take it off of this. These are my predictions. And so this is what I think how the Super Bowl is gonna end up. So you guys gotta subscribe if you're new, leave a comment, hit the like button, and bye bye.